Well, I think part of the answer is at least uh, the political pressure that the court has been under. So remember when the court announced uh, the prosecutor's office announced that they would be investigating uh, violations of the Rome Statute um, that occurred in Afghanistan and in Palestine uh, around 2020. The, the U.S. actually imposed sanctions on the uh, ICC, the then prosecutor Fatou Ben Souda, um, and uh, revoked her U.S. visa. And so there's at least that political element that's at play here. Um, but I think that really... Uh, Kareem Khan needs to act. He could have issued arrest warrants months ago, and we're seeing greater criticism of how he's handling this situation. Hundreds of scholars and practitioners of international law submitted an open letter to the Assembly of State Parties um, regarding the Office of the Prosecutor's engagement with this case. And this letter, I encourage everyone to read it, raises questions surrounding his impartiality, and his entire handling of this matter. So he really needs to move much quicker than he has. There hasn't even been an update in terms of news on the ICC website with respect to the case in Palestine since November. And this is really just unacceptable.